Welcome back everyone, I hope you're all doing it, having a great day. Today we are going to be talking about few things here, starting with the bundles and using platinum for some of the things that we can do inside Diablo Immortal. So first up, let's start with the bundles. What are the things that I have purchased recently in past few months? Because I have not been doing much of a spending inside the Diablo immortal other than few things here and there because i am a content creator and there are few things which i do to create some content for you guys uh, starting with what i have recently purchased uh, one is going to be if we go to the services i end up buying a boon of plenty you can see uh, this is a really nice quality of life feature for myself and allows me to open the market from uh, wherever i want and also increase the amount of items i can carry in my inventory when i am doing farming so this is like a quality of life feature that i am paying for and on the top of that it gives me that farming fang that is good and some gems and the rare Rest daily. This is not something I buy every month. I end up buying this recently because of the two new weapons that came out. Mines are currently 17. I have ton of materials saved that I just not used yet. Just a bit lazy. I think 20,000 scrap or more and a lot of dust too. Just lazy to use it. And so that is why I'm like uh, keeping that boon of plenty for this so I have more space. And other than that, what I have purchased here is if we go to services, a project part, I end up actually buying both of them. Uh, recently, I end up buying the project part 3. And uh, only today, I end up buying the new one. And it does give me nice keys here and some rare crests which in my in, in my opinion is good also comes with about 1280 internet up now i purchased this because so i could create some content for you guys running some uh, legendary crests and uh, those are good and i will be like saving a turner up for maybe next cosmetic the cross server one whenever it will come out we'll try and see if i can obtain somewhat close to even 11,000 in few months we'll see if i want to roll that or maybe just run some more eternal crest not sure and another thing that i wanted to do in this video was is it worth it to uh, run the legacy of wardrum ibn fire sanctum using your platinum i don't think that is all that worth it now especially I have upgraded it high enough that the cost has gone up so high is not worth it for me to upgrade it a bit more. I've been slacking on this here and there. We will go and open up everything that this has to offer today. So the keys that I have from the Borge the bot that is worth more than 20,000 platinum. Uh, 600 keys or so uh, not 600 but 400 some 600 keys i believe so it has 600 keys which is what more than 20,000 platinum itself and also gives you about 1280 eternal orbs and on the top of that it also gives you 12 legendary crests so uh, for me it was worth it to come up and uh, create this content here with you guys and talk about it and I also want to talk about something else towards the end that is going to be alt account. But is it worth going to open like every single chest for me now? I want to show you guys that. What do we have here? A good essence. Let's pick this up. We have one more room left and then i will maybe just maybe will able to upgrade something because the cost is skyrocketed to the point that is really hard to upgrade anything even if i was using platinum 
All right, so we have these. Let's open all chests. I will still be left with some decent keys that I can use tomorrow. And that is good. So let's grab everything and go open the big chest in the middle. It gives you some extra. And if we go in mid now to the shrine and see some of the things that I've been focusing on is the armor penetration it is rank 27 this armor is rank 29 you can see it needs 18 armor so the cost has gone up so much that uh, is not the best way to use your platinum at least for me and i can upgrade this gives me armor armor penetration but you can look at the stats that i'm getting here from lexio wardroom over 774 armor and around 738 armor penetration because this is something i've been actually trying to upgrade still behind once i will uh, reach some decent level here rank 30 then i will try and upgrade some of my other one to higher levels life and damage is two things i'm just not focusing on and this one at the bottom but this is how it looks and in my opinion if you are using platinum and close to flower 30 it might not be worth it to use your platinum unless you get some free keys like i just got from the project e pot and the last thing i want to talk about is using else uh i've been getting so many questions still if it's okay to use else account inside diablo immortal and my answer has always been the same uh, they have made some changes to the how the chinese version of the game is working in china but they have not made any changes for the global version of the diablo immortal as long as you play any account yourself you are okay to play as you please like i said play yourself do not cheat using uh, a pilot, like hiring someone to pilot your else. Do not cheat using a third party software. Do not cheat using micro boss. And you should be fine. You can play some extra character, make some platinum for your main. Uh, that should be fine. They have not made any changes for the global version of Diablo Immortals, like what we know. And we, we even asked them and they basically said that the global version of the Diablo Immortal is managed by Blizzard and the Chinese version is managed by NetEase so don't read into Chinese patch notes. Uh, anyhow I'm signing off that was just me today more casual video of what I do inside Diablo Immortal things I am spending a bit on and if it's worth it for me now to open the Legacy of Wardroom and uh, a little bit touching on the subject of else signing off see you guys in the next one till then as always have fun and take care if you guys have any questions you can ask me in the comment section i always go through uh, comments in all my videos and see you guys in the next one take care